As we know, Badara is absolutely a stunning resort. What does it take to operate a, a luxury accommodation place like that? It's all okay. fun, isn't it? Uh, it is. It is. It, you know, it takes wonderful staff, which is what we're very uh, proud and lucky to have. So the staff has been huge, but we were uh, we were lucky enough or unlucky enough to take over Vidara after Cyclone Yazi. So we were met with quite a lot of destruction, but we were very, uh, we wanted to help the community and it was also a real passion of ours. Sam had been homeschooled on Vidara when he was a little boy. So it's quite a backstory, which we had a, a real labor of love to bring it back to life. And we reopened in 2013 and it's uh, gone from strength to strength and we're thrilled with it. So just going back to the homeschooling yes. on the <laughs> He never tells anyone. What? <laughs> Please explain. Yeah. Yeah, there's a little bit of a background story. We, yeah, when I was 11 years old, I spent a year living on the island. There was an old hermit who, who uh, had a small portion of the island that he subdivided, and my parents were lucky enough to buy one of the blocks of land that he subdivided, and we just spent a year and a half living there and uh, yeah, not doing much at all. So you must have an absolute passion for oh, that. Oh, I absolutely yeah. love it. It's a really stunning location. Um, it's it's beautiful, and, and and I guess that's sort of what the I guess the foundation of what the resort is is based on just the beauty of the place. And uh, and uh, yeah, we've just sort of tried to create an experience there that is relaxed but luxurious, yeah. personalised, and uh, um, yeah, we love it. Yeah, we do. Yeah. What's this award going to mean to you and also to tourism in the tropical north? Well, look, I, for us, it's a, it's a recognition, I think, of, I guess, the work that we've put in to the resort and also the work that the team's put into the resort. Uh, and then I think for, for tourism in the north or tropical north Queensland, it's, again, a recognition that, that it is a spectacular part of the country and... Uh, um, yeah, that we offer something that, that's unique and, and spectacular and beautiful and can compete with anywhere in the world.